Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls and here is our daily inspiration card. But before we go down that road, angelsouls444.com if you would like an angelic messaging reading or an Akashic Records reading, or we could do a live reading. We've been having so much fun with those. <laughs> They're really great and it's so nice to see your beautiful faces. I know your names, but you know, from comments or being a client or whatever, but I don't often get to see you. So it's a great opportunity. Just email me at angelsouls444 at gmail.com. I'll let you know about pricing, availability, all that good stuff. And always check out the description box because I'm going to be having live hangouts on the Bright platform along with other more educational sessions. Okay? Cool sessions. I promise. All right? So you have Knight of Ariel. Let me feel this out before... Be careful with this. I mean, this is a nice opportunity, but this is someone who's trying to act like they're rich or more powerful than they actually are. They might have some pull. They might be able to put a good word in for you somewhere, but they don't have the power to hire you, fire you. It could be somebody who's like, listen, I can help you, but... Someone else is the decision maker. That's what it feels like. All right. So trustworthy, understanding, devoted, funny. Someone very grounded. Uh, there's so much to accomplish. Make a very detailed plan. Being watched over by someone kind. Yeah, this I'm hearing jumping off point. So there's somebody who can help you get started. And again, move you along a little bit. But the work is yours. <laughs> okay. That's what I'm feeling. I know that's like people who read terribly like, what are you even talking about? Listen. <laughs> This is a blended deck. Okay, leave me alone. But this is grounded, meaning well. The reason why I keep saying, you know, this is somebody who doesn't have as much power as maybe they lead on or maybe what you perceive them to have. Let's put it that way. So this might be the director, but he's not the CEO. Okay, he might be a VP, but he's not the CEO. So they still have to answer to someone. And I bring that up because you might really get your hopes up about something or oh my god oh i'm sorry okay so someone might be dating someone out there who's like yeah i'm so ready to move on and you realize that they're married that's not what this means this card but that's just another message that i felt someone's watching who's got that scenario going on sorry i had to put that out there so just manage your expectations here because again part of this messaging is you're putting too much into something that might not come to fruition or that is not guaranteed or again you need to put the work in instead of expecting it to be handed to you now that's not going to be everybody who has that kind of attitude this could also be something that you're trying and you're doing pretty well with it but you need to be ready for the roller coaster why is that you know listen hey yo we can say all the live long day and be like here are the traditional meanings of these cards. I don't care. I mean, I do care. I don't want people being completely off the rails with these. But <laughs> but what I'm getting at here is the world is changing around us so much that how we show up within it is going to have to adapt. Okay? We need to start turning things around. So again, a good idea, a pretty successful idea, whatever it is that you're working towards, but there is work to be done to bring it into the physical. Fair? Okay. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.